Hello everyone and welcome to another test of the Minor League. This time I am with... Brawny Face. What a beautiful name you have. And a delicious one. Yes. Now, let's do Pan versus Pilaf. Machine. Yes. Well, Pilaf is not a machine, but he you get what we're saying. Hey, yes. the old blue bada di da da da. No, no, no. Did you at least did it in the blue test? Well, he is blue. No, I didn't. Okay, well, time for the B ones. Alright, Pan has Saiyan Soul, which boosts her melee and her B2 for 5 seconds. Yes. Which is terrible. Yes, her second B2 is after a strike. You meant B1. Yes. Okay. The B1 is of Pilaf. It's the. The, ba the barrier. To How do we say that in English? Pilaf barrier. Okay, I always say barrier. It's in French. Oh, uh, it's okay. It's it's sophisticated. Yes. I would even say it's sophisticated. And I think the other one is false to rate. It is. Now for the B twos. Pilaf have rolling smash and keeps rolling. And Rotro. Is is it a Psy set Rotro or it's like a. Hmm? The Pilaf. Is it Psy set Rotro or Rotro? Is it's, a, it's a Rotro. Yeah, it's it throws a rock. I think it's Zion Rotro. Okay. And for. Well, and Rotro, Giant Rotro. Yeah, he throws a rock. Yeah. And for pants, you have the Tamiamea and the. Uh, Get on the soul. Yeah, I forgot for the name of the robot. Uh, so, who would you say have the best B2s? Mm -hmm. In all honesty, I think they are equal as both of their B2s are useful and some odd reason the rock through connects a lot. I will personally give the advantage to Pilaf. I am a bit fan of the move like the Ronin Smash and okay. the Drop Throat and it way more often than the Tamiamea. It was a fast match. Yes. Oh, yeah, and also we didn't say it, but Pilaf have a transformation like we saw. Yes, and I wonder if uh, in the minor they will allow Pilaf to be transformed uh, for this season. I'm not sure about that. I would like to say that. I would like to, but we ain't the boss around here. No, you'll see. Okay, another match. Well, yes. uh, the B2s of Pilaf while transform are the Datling Dun and the Double Buster. Yes, the Double Buster is uh, awful. It's not really good. Well, it is not good. He, he generally doesn't connect with his both of his beam. Just so he has a tendency to just connect with one. His Gatling gun, if they connect all, it does a really decent amount of damage. Well, I will even say good. Yeah. Okay, now for the ultimate. Um, the ultimate of Pan is. It's made on something, if I recall. It's a rush uh, ultimate. It does average damage. Yes, and the one of Pilaf is also a rush ultimate. It is also a Pilaf's grand operation. Yes, when he he received the help of his two allies. Yes, and the parade. And somehow, and somehow it hurts. Yes. And this is second ultimate war transform, it's the missile. Yeah. 
and throws a missile from his nether region. Hey, <laughs> that seemed like a fun it Japanese is. joke. So, personally, I think Pilaf. Uh, mm, he has a really questionable melee, in my opinion. But he has. Oh, he charges like an android, and I like his transformation. Yeah. Well, especially transform. I prefer Pilaf to Pan, but. I don't know. Uh, uh, uh. It's really cool on my opinion. Yes, it's pretty hard to say. Um, the two of them seem to me pretty equal. I mean, oh, oh, yeah, it's pretty hard to say who's best. But now, for who would be a good starter? Do you think that one of these two can be a starter? Pilar has a more of chance of being a starter than Pan, in my opinion, to be more efficient at being a starter. But uh, both of the characters uh, have a good potential of being uh, tagging characters. Yeah, I I want I do not see one of these two being the 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 starters for a team. 